The big game is fast approaching, but wait, you still haven't got your tickets. You've spent hours searching, but you're still confused about ticket prices. Time to stop searching. Visit TicketCompare.com. We compare ticket prices for all the popular leagues and tournaments for you. We work only with the most trustworthy sites, so you can have peace of mind when buying your tickets. Compare prices, buy tickets, get to the game. TicketCompare.com. Buying tickets made simple. Uh, okay, caught everyone by surprise today. It's good. Okay, afternoon everybody. Thanks for coming. Usual format, we'll do a broadcast. Uh, any international colleagues that are here in agencies and then we'll move to written, which includes a Sunday today. Um, Kave, where you go? Antonio, well, first hey. of all, is uh, N'Golo Kante fit to play on Sunday? Do you think he'll be available? He's progressing well. Huh? He's progressing well. And, uh, yeah. We have also... Uh, tomorrow, and, uh, and then uh, yeah, I'll take uh, the best decision for him, for uh, for for the team. Yeah, but for sure, uh, Golo is progressing well, and uh, I'm very happy for uh, for this. You know very well uh, uh, that we are talking about uh, an important player, and. Uh, You said on Tuesday night uh, in Rome that you were disappointed with the second half display, especially because uh, it was lacking hunger and fight. What do you think will happen on Sunday if your players are lacking hunger and fight again? But, uh, honestly, I think uh, that. Uh, uh, yeah, the, the second half, the second half uh, against Roma was uh, uh, was badly, and uh, uh, in uh, in many different aspects. Yeah, but um, I think that um, sometimes can happen. The most important thing is that this type of situation you don't see uh, again uh, uh, this uh, this type of situation because. Uh, we played a, a really good first half, and we were to kneel down. But uh, honestly, uh, I was uh, more worried after the first half uh, in Stafford Bridge, when uh, we were winning two uh, to one. But uh, we um, uh, didn't have the, the, the control of the game, uh, and uh, instead of the first half, uh, I was more confident for our. Uh, second half. Instead, it happened that the second half was very, very negative. Uh, but now it's the past. It's the past, and now it's important to prepare very well this uh, this game against Manchester United, and to try to to do our uh, our best on Sunday. You know, last season there was so much uh, positivity around the club. Everything was very positive. You're winning so many games, 93 points in the league. This season there seems to be a bit more of a mood of negativity uh, around the club. Why do you think that is? Uh, are you happy with the attitude of your players and their behaviour this season? But uh, For sure, for sure I'm uh, I'm happy. I'm happy for uh, I'm happy to to work with uh, with my players for sure because uh, I repeat that the commitment is uh, is uh, is always good. But uh, uh, in this season we are struggling. We are struggling a lot uh, because uh, we are facing a lot of uh, important problems, and uh, to solve these problems uh, is not simple. It's not simple, and uh, but I, I think. Uh, in this uh, in this moment that you can see uh, uh, if uh, if you are a, a winner or a loser, understand? I think this is very important. This moment because when the uh, the period is positive, uh, it's uh, very simple for everyone uh, uh, to play well, uh, to have a great confidence, uh, to. In this uh, in this moment, in this moment that you are struggling, you are struggling. Uh, and uh, it's important to show uh, our uh, character, uh, to be uh, strong, to face uh, the problem uh, uh, in the right way. And uh, then, 
Yeah, but uh, I'm a, I'm a used uh, in my life. Uh, uh, I'm used to do this, and uh, I I struggled a lot in my life uh, uh, as a player and uh, and then as a, as a coach and also I'm uh, uh, my my history my my, sto- my history uh, tell this. Of course, on Sunday, Jose Mourinho uh, is coming back to Stamford Bridge. Um, what is your relationship like with him? Uh, do you like him as a man, as a manager? Is it- I think it's not important uh, the relationship between the, the coaches. Yeah, uh, you have uh, to respect uh, the job of the other coach. I stop. Then I don't. Uh, I don't like. Uh, <laughs> If I uh, to speak about uh, the uh, situation, and uh, I have a, a respect for the job, I stop and finish. Then he is an opponent, uh, and uh, I'm an opponent for uh, for uh, for him. And uh, after the game, uh, it will be the same. Is there any problem at all between you and him? No, but I repeat, it's not important. This and for me is uh, is an opponent. I stop and finish. I have respect for his job. He must have respect for my job. And stop. You shake his hand before and after the game. Carve, come on. Yeah, I finish and stop like five times. Let's move uh, on. Just turning to somebody else who will be coming back to Stanford Cup on Sunday is uh, Nemanja Matic. A lot of Chelsea supporters don't understand what, why he, he left in the summer. Can you just clarify what, why he left the club? No, I, I think that uh, now uh, Matic is, uh, is a United player, and you know very well that I don't like to speak about uh, about uh, other uh, other players of the other teams, and uh, I do the same also in this uh, in, uh, in this situation. But if you remember, um, I have uh, already answered this question in the past. Jonathan? Well, Tony, um, you haven't played the same team this season in consecutive matches. Um, is, is that one of the problems for the inconsistencies, would you say? And, um, but for sure now, uh, if, you, uh, uh, if you see the stats, and uh, the stats uh, speaks very, very well, no? that now, uh, we are less uh, uh, consistency uh, than uh, than last season. Uh, now we are uh, less solid uh, than uh, than last season. But I think that uh, uh, we have to continue to to work uh, to try to improve. Um, then for sure uh, in uh, in in this period uh, we we played uh, uh, always with the same players, uh, and then uh, when you play. When the same players, uh, for sure, uh, in uh, in uh, some aspect, you can lose uh, something. You can earn something in the other aspect, but uh, you can lose uh, something in uh, in other. So, do you think you need a bit less rotation and a bit more consistency in the team? But I think I think during uh, during a season, uh, um, uh, it's it's very important to uh, to make the rotation because. Uh, if you think to play with the same players, it means that you have players uh, uh, that play the third games in seven days. Uh, you have players very tired. Uh, you, have, you have players with great risk to have uh, an injury. But I think uh, modern football uh, is uh, is this. Uh, in the modern football, uh, you uh, you have to to think to have uh, the, the the rotation. Has Roman Abramovich been down to the training ground this week to watch to watch you train since the the Roman game? Roman game. Mm. Um, yeah, Mr. Abramovich uh, 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 was uh, in, uh, in in Coban on Sunday after uh, Bartmont game. Yeah, uh, to to watch the the training, uh, to speak, uh, but uh, yeah, it's normal this. Obviously, we never speak to him or hear from him. Is he is he happy with the way things are progressing at the club? But honestly, uh, we spoke about uh, about uh, Bournemouth games, and then 
the first game against uh, against Rome. We spoke about about this. Manchester United on Sunday. How do you expect them to approach the game? And we are talking about uh, 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 a really good team, uh, a strong team physically, and. Uh, it it will be very difficult this uh, this type of game uh, also because uh, uh, this uh, this is an important team and uh, we must pay great attention. Uh, but we are working we are, we are working to prepare this game in in the right way. Uh, yeah, but I think that uh, United uh, is uh, is a really uh, good team. Is it fair to say you can't afford to lose the game if you want to remain in the title race, or is it too early to, to make statements like that? But I think I think now that uh, um, there is uh, uh, a big problems for uh, uh, for all, all the teams that want to fight for the title, and these big problems is Manchester City. <laughs> yeah. Because if Manchester City continues this way. <laughs> Do you think they're that far ahead uh, at the moment? I know, but uh, I think uh, this is the, the, the big problem for, uh, for all the teams that uh, are thinking to fight uh, for, uh, for the title. Because uh, if they, uh, they continue in this way, uh, it will be very difficult to, to fight for, uh, for the title. And, uh, but for sure, uh, we have to try to do uh, our, uh, our best in every game. And, uh, I think that uh, until now uh, we uh, we deserve to have uh, uh, these points. Then uh, uh, we know what it's like to win the title. Can you, can you see them continuing playing at this this level over a whole season, Man City? But, but I, I don't know. I don't know honestly. But uh, until now uh, they they uh, they are having a. a a fantastic uh, uh, path, fantastic path, and uh, if they continue this way, it will be very difficult for uh, for all the teams to to try to uh, to fight for the title until the end. Please. Some they feel like a bigger game than probably the, the games in the city and Stamford Bridge to you. It feels like a big game to everyone else. It feel like a bigger game to you. Yeah, uh, I think uh, when when you play against, against Manchester United, when you play against uh, uh, City, Arsenal, Liverpool, Tottenham, uh, 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 I think that uh, is a, it's a, always a, a big game, and uh, I think uh, this type of game uh, must, must excite the, uh, the players. Uh, to play in a fantastic atmosphere, uh, to play and to know that uh, uh, the game, uh, yeah, a lot of people uh, will uh, will watch the game, you know, in the whole uh, in the whole world. Yeah, I think uh, this is a really big, uh, big game. Do you feel under pressure? I mean, uh, every week I've seen Premier League <laughs> managers and it, like, lose two games. Wow, well, they're under pressure. They could get sacked. I mean, do you feel under pressure right now? But honestly, I, I feel I feel uh, uh, I feel always uh, 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 the same pressure, the same pressure because uh, um, before the game uh, I feel uh, I feel the pressure uh, uh, to win in every game, and uh, last season uh, is the same. Uh, when you stay on top of the table, you feel the pressure uh, to win because you want to continue to stay top of the table. Uh, I, I feel uh, always the the same pressure, and uh, this is very this is very important because uh, above all for me now because I'm a passionate man. I have a great enthusiasm, and uh, uh, I need I need to feel this type of pressure. Do you, do you like the pressure? Yeah, I like a pressure. I like a pressure. I think that uh, I was born with the pressure. <laughs> uh, one last one from me. Um, two of your employees got called up by England yesterday, Tammy Abraham and Ruben Loftus-Cheek, which is good news for Chelsea going forward, and maybe for you, if you're still here, going forward. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Touch me, eh? <laughs> yeah. Uh, 
and uh, no, but but I think uh, that uh, these uh, uh, these players uh, uh, are having uh, the the right uh, the right um, uh, the right path, the right uh, development, and uh, it's very important uh, for uh, for these players to play regularly and uh, yeah to show to show that uh, they are ready uh, to be uh, Chelsea's players. Don't forget that the pressure is totally different uh, if you play in uh, in a team that uh, is fighting for the relegation zone and then to fight for uh, for something important, to win something important. But I think uh, this is the right path. The right path for uh, for Ruben, uh, for Tammy is uh, the right path, and uh, I'm very happy that uh, they are doing very well. Martin. Uh, hi Antonio. Does Victor Moses have any chance of playing on Sunday? Uh, no, zero chance. Yeah, but uh, the uh, Moses injury was uh, was a bad injury, uh, a bad ma- muscular problem. Yeah, and uh, we have to wait. We have to wait uh, to have patience, uh, and uh, he needs uh, uh, more time uh, before to, to to recover. One one other question: Could you explain why Gary Cahill played on the right of the back three? <coughs> played almost all the time for you on the left. <laughs> Uh, I think uh, I think that uh, honestly, I don't want to 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 answer this question. But not it is not disrespectful for you. Eh? It's not disrespectful for you. But who has uh, who must understand understand? This is my answer. Understand? So, so do you play on the on the right again. No, 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 no. He's very good to play on the left. He, we won uh, uh, a league with the, with the Kail in this position. Yeah, I don't know. I don't understand why uh, we have to to try again uh, to put him uh, on the right. So is but it's a good question. Is, uh, is that yeah. you admitting it was a mistake on Tuesday? Uh, maybe, maybe. But I think that uh, Kail. Uh, uh, can play on the right, on the left, but uh, the best position for him, uh, for me, uh, is uh, is uh, on the left. But sometimes can uh, can happen uh, uh, some misunderstanding. You understand? But it's important then to clarify the situation. And will he play on Sunday? Uh, yeah, 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 for sure. Yeah, for sure. Kail uh, will play. Will play for sure. Ali. Hi, Antonio. I just want to go back to um, N'Golo Kante for a moment. He's been such an important player for Chelsea. How difficult is it as a manager, obviously, if he's not 100% fit? Are you willing to, to risk him because he's so important for you and for your team? But uh, I, honestly, if uh, uh, I wanted to risk him uh, and uh, uh, I could do this uh, against Bournemouth, I could do this uh, against Rome, instead uh, I... I waited. I I found in myself a lot of patience uh, to try the best way for the N'Golo. It means that uh, if I decide to uh, to put him uh, on the team uh, and uh, to start the game, uh, uh, it will be uh, ready to do this. Otherwise, uh, I repeat, and uh, I could do uh, this uh, uh, against Bournemouth and against Rome. Which team do you think this game is most important for? Obviously, Manchester United trying hard to close the gap uh, with Manchester City, and, and for yourselves, obviously needing to recover quickly from that Champions League defeat. Who does it feel bigger for? Yeah, but 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 I think when when there is a big team, a big a big game, uh, and uh, uh, every team wants uh, uh, want to win. I want to win, and uh, but it's normal uh, and. Uh, uh, Manchester United uh, uh, has uh, uh, their problems, but uh, <laughs> Chelsea uh, has uh, the, uh, his problem, and for this reason we want to try to solve our problem. For sure, big game, and both teams will try, uh, will try to, to win the game. Do you think there'll be an element of revenge for Mourinho after the 4-0 defeat last season? Uh, could you repeat, please? Um, because uh, Manchester United lost last season 4-0, do you think Mourinho w- wants to come back and, and get some revenge for that defeat? 
Uh, but uh, I don't forget that uh, uh, they uh, they won uh, to nil uh, in, uh, in in the second game uh, at home. Yeah, I think. I think uh, every every coach, every player, every uh, team uh, want to win. Want to win, not for a revenge, but because uh, you need you need to win. Just one last one from me. Uh, Manchester United have been um, criticised a lot for playing defensive football. Have you done much work on on sort of how to? Counter that if they do come to the bridge. No, I don't care. I don't care. I don't care about this. I don't care. I don't care. I think only my my team, only my players. I think uh, that uh, every uh, every coach in this case, uh, uh, me, I have to think uh, to try to improve my my team and not to look uh, at the other. I think uh, that uh, this is not the right way to look uh, uh, other teams or other uh, players, other coaches. Mike Ryan. Antonio, last time you went down against a team in the Premier League was against Watford, and uh, you went to win that game. After the game, you said the players showed you a fighting spirit. What was the difference in attitude to the role game where you said they lost hunger and attitude? But uh, I don't know. But uh, can happen. Can happen this. Can happen this because uh, I was player, and uh, sometimes it happened that uh, you want to to do. Uh, uh, a lot, but uh, you are not able to do this. Can happen. Can happen. <laughs> the most important thing is that uh, this is only uh, uh, an isolated case. Okay. Thanks, everyone. Cameras off, please. Thank you. Sorry. No.